Hello, this is Carla back again with another video. Um, today, I wanted to talk about um, how if we are only focused on our physicalness, our physical bodies, um, and this physical earth or realm that, that you're in, um, that we will be missing half of it. You're missing half of your wholeness if you're only physically focus. So what I mean by that is that we, I mean, we're, we're more than that. We're way more than that. We're spirits. Um, we're really spirits living a human um, experience at this time, but we're truly spirits. Um, this is kind of like just the body is like our clothes. It, it, it goes away. It's going to go away and we'll be left with the spirit, right? So um, I just wanted to talk about a little bit um, how you can become a little bit more spiritually focused. That way you can have a balance um, between the physical and the spiritual, which, would, which really makes your life so much better. When you're in touch with your spirit, when you're in touch with that piece of you that never goes away, um, you, when you're... When you're focused on both, you get a lot of help from the spirit world. Um, and that's just, when I say that, I just mean your spirit guides. I mean, there are, you have spirits that are put here just to help you through this life. Literally, they're all around you, but you have to ask for their help. You have to ask for their help. You have to say, I want your help because they can't interfere with your, um, with your free will. Okay, so getting in touch with your spiritual side um, helps you to get in touch with the spiritual realm. Um, and it's very, very important. Since I've done this, it has completely changed my life. Um, the way that you do this is first, meditation, of course, because what happens in meditation is that you will start to listen to your thoughts right? You're quiet. You're trying to be quiet, but at first your mind's going to keep going, going, going. And so if you can be the observer in the background, which is your spirit, <laughs> your spirit is right here just watching you and just trying to live through you if you allow it to. Um, okay. So yes, um, the spirit guides, your spirit guides want to help you um, evolve, want to help you. The whole point is to evolve in this life. Um, it's, the point's not just to, you know, walk around here being human because you're not human. You are right now, but that's not who you are in the grand scheme of things, right? So um, meditation You'll start to hear those thoughts. You'll start to, um, and then you'll start to realize, wait a minute, that wasn't my thought. That was some other thought. That was way beyond my, my knowledge. Like sometimes you'll just get a thought, you think it's a thought, that, that just blows you away. And you're like, how did I just think that? I didn't even know anything about anything like this, right? Well, that's not you. That's your spirit guides. That's your higher self. That's your your future self, which is all right now, right? Your past, your future, all of it's right this second. None of it's really, you know, none of it's really, it's all happening right now. Your future is happening right now. <laughs> so you can get guidance from your future self. You can get guidance from your spirit guides, your angels. They're all around you and they're just wanting to help you and they're giving you signs and you're not even seeing them because you're paying attention to the past or you're worried about the future or damn, this person did this to me or that person or the political stuff or the virus or whatever. But we don't listen to our spirit and to the spirit world that are trying to help us. Okay. So I would, um, I just want to suggest that you start to get tapped into that world because that is the real world. Okay. Um, that's the forever world. 
that's your that's your evolution you know um so listen to your thoughts realize you'll start to realize when a thought is it yours then you can ask questions as well and your spirit guides will help you you can ask a question and be quiet and listen be quiet and listen and when you do that typically the first thought you have will be that answer you don't you can't use your logical mind when you do things like this you have to l listen for the answers they come through your heart they come through your heart they don't come through your mind <laughs> so listen for the guidance play with it a little bit um, you can literally God, there's just so much. There's so much on this that I could talk about, and I'll make more videos about it if you'd like. Let me know if you would like to, to know more about that, because um, you can you can send you can be in other places as you're here now because it's all happening at the same time, right? Um, I know this is a little esoteric and a little woo woo for some people, but this is real. This is not woo woo. This is absolutely real and this is beautiful and the energy of all these spirits and of your spirit and your higher self is of pure love and love overcomes everything once you have that you have no fear once you have that you have no you'll still have problems because you're still like living you know in the third dimensional third density earth where most people are walking around asleep um but um, but yeah, I will make, this is my beautiful daughter. Hi. Come on, Ariana, come show yourself. Really? Okay, she says no. Um, so thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and like it if you did. Um, and let me know if you want to hear more about the spirit world from me. Thank you.